Deep beneath the surface of the ocean, halfway between Australia and Antarctica, lie ancient dormant volcanoes. Don't be fooled by what you see. These are mountains, some taller than Hobart's Kunani, Mount Wellington. This seamount is more than 1,500 metres tall off of the seafloor surface. So it is quite large. Researchers on board the Investigator have been mapping part of the seafloor in the path of the Antarctic Circumpolar Current, an area spanning 20,000 square kilometres to the west of Macquarie Island. So we've found four pairs of um, these amazing seamounts. So they would have been active a long time ago in the past, so probably the 10 to 20 million year range. Dubbed drones of the ocean, these gliders are controlled remotely from Hobart and the US, deployed to corroborate what can be seen from space. What we want to be able to do is get the, the subsurface information that we can pair with what the satellite's seeing at the surface, and together we can construct a 3D view of the ocean current. The Antarctic Circumpolar Current serves as a natural barrier for the icy continent, but with so much heat being absorbed by the ocean, some of it is getting through that barrier. Scientists are trying to determine the path that heat is taking. To really track how the ocean is, is responding to the efforts that we make to reduce carbon dioxide in the atmosphere. The investigator is expected to return to Hobart tomorrow. The data it collects will be analysed by researchers in the United States, France and Australia. Lily Thompson, ABC News.